Amit, microgrids have for years been seen as the perhaps the ultimate solution to universal energy access. But as we just discovered in the panel, they could do an awful lot more. From your own experience, what is the cutting edge of microgrid R&D these days? Thanks, I think that's a very valid question. Earlier, microgrids were a solution only for, uh, for areas where the grid did not exist. Whereas now, microgrids are in fact a very good, good test bed for, uh, for testing the ingress, uh, the high level of ingress of renewables, which can then be applied to the broader system as a whole, where renewables are, uh, are in excess of 20% or 30% are being deployed. So the frontier of research is in how to, to improve the current distributed management systems to handle, uh, to handle uh, very sharp changes in the generation or sharp changes in demand in a way that grid stability can be managed. So we are looking at distributed energy resource management systems, how to integrate renewables at that high level to manage, uh, to manage the grids of the future. And that's where uh, we are focusing all of our resources. The test bed that we have in Reeds in Semakau Island is one of the, uh, the very safe ways in which this can be tested. And, uh, and, uh, and that's uh, one of the solutions that we offer all of our corporate partners, including Schneider Electric.